The children's blizzard hit the U.S. plain states on January 12, 1888. The blizzard came unexpectedly on a relatively warm day, and many people were caught unaware, including children who were on their way home from school. 235 people died, with most of those being kids. During the storm, Minnie Freeman safely led 13 children from her schoolhouse to her home, one and a half miles or 2.4 kilometers away. Lois Royce found herself trapped with three of her students in her schoolhouse. By 3 p.m., they had run out of heating fuel. Her boarding house was only 82 yards away, so she attempted to leave the children there. However, visibility was so poor that she became lost, and the children, two nine-year-old boys and a six-year-old girl, froze to death. The teacher survived, but her feet were frostbitten and had to be amputated. 